Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Rachel right here. Today I have an unboxing for you. Now this comes from the company prettyneatcreative.com and I was I was actually contacted by a woman named Emma. Thank you Emma for reaching out in my email and she wanted to see me test this and just look at the quality of their diamond paintings and I thought why not. Um, I've seen Pretty Neat Creative online before and I know that there are other diamond painters who are affiliated with their company and I thought you know what why not they say that they have poured glue paintings and this came in a tube so yeah um let's try to dig in I know you can't see it right now but trust me there's a lot of tape on this sucker all right let's see if we can nope all right one second Okay, safety first, always cut away from yourself. <laughs> so it was wrapped up in quite a lot of this kind of trash bag material, which is great, it, it was just fine. Um, there are a few dents in the tube, but I'm sure that it's gonna be fine. Have a look at this, guys. Okay, so there's a cool top to it. It says, pretty neat, creative, feel the beauty in diamonds. And they've got a little quote down here. It shows you how to do diamond painting if you're new, six steps. Very nice. They have a Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest account. Let's have a look inside. This is so interesting. I like the tube, that's, that's pretty cool. All right, now I told her to surprise me, so I have no idea what's coming. <laughs> All right, so that's the, that's the tube done. And there is a, just gonna put that back together. That's the tube over there. Uh, there is a thank you, 15% off. Whoever's first can go ahead and grab that. <laughs> um, and look, there is the canvas inside a bag. It looks like a soft canvas, very nice. It's very protected. It comes with a toolkit. It's got sharp tweezers, a clear pen with a four placer, wax, purple squishy, little boat, and some baggies. Very nice. Looks to be like eight baggies in there. Very good. This is taped. This is so soft. That's really nice. Um, it feels like cotton. I am worried about taking this off now. With a whatchamacallit, it's a nice cottony soft canvas, feels like a t-shirt, <laughs> but not a jersey t-shirt. All right, are you ready? I'm, I'm, I'm ready to be surprised. I said vibrant bright colors. Ooh, cool. Okay, so we have some pretty daisies. Uh, I think they're daisies or flowers, a 30 by 40 with 29 colors. Now there's some drills loose there. That's nice. Okay, what I'm gonna try to do, look, it's it's actually flattening itself. That's really cool. It's got an inventory sheet, so there you go. That's what it looks like. Look how pretty that is. That's so cute. And it's got DMC numbers and the symbols very clearly here on the piece of paper. You could use your sticker maker if you have one. To make stickers for your storage. Ooh, they come in their own baggies. Very nice. And they are labeled with the color number and the DMC number. Excellent. I know there's a lot of glare today. Sorry, it's very bright all of a sudden. Wow. That's nice. Okay. Oh, that glue is super sticky. Very nice. I keep saying very nice because I'm just kind of surprised. Um, if we roll it just a little bit loosely the other way, maybe we'll get the top to kind of lay a little flatter. There we go. Awesome. Look at the detail. That's actually quite good for a 30 by 40. You've got the, the leaf and the stem. You've got some pretty fern in the background. There's a lot of color blocking on this. So let's get down to the canvas and have a look closer. 
Okay, so this is a square drill canvas, and if we look really closely, I'm just having a look at the symbols themselves and how clear it is to see them. They look printed pretty well. There doesn't seem to be too much of trouble looking for similar symbols at the moment in the color ranges, but they look to be different enough that there isn't too much of a problem. Even here with the shamrock and the hearts, they're different enough that I can tell that they're all right. So let's see, there's no B and eight, thank goodness. <laughs> um, they look to be super clear. Yeah, awesome. And that drill field, I mean, it's hard to get a super, super clear drill field, but this looks like it was almost yeah, photo printed. Amazing. That's that's how it should look. That's really good, y'all. Okay, let's look over here. I'm gonna go slow so I don't make anybody sick. So you can see how how definite these colors are. There's a good a bit bit of color changing in some areas where there should be. A little confetti but then you have big areas of one color which is nice it's kind of relaxing to just go for it you know so that's awesome now there are no AB drills or anything like that that I can see on the legend but who knows we might be surprised so let's have a look at the drills okay here we go let's open it up Okay, are they in order? They look to be very nearly in order. So two, three, four. There's one, six, seven, eight, we scratched out the one. <laughs> uh, nine, ten, I like that they're in order. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, Nine and eight. Okay, there's another little loose drill inside the bag, but overall, I think all the bags are closed. Maybe they just kind of hitched a ride <laughs> into into my um, into my bag. All right, let's get a little closer. I'm going to show you the colors. These are some of the colors. I'm just going to go through and look at the drills and see you know, what kind of quality we're working with. You know how I am. This is a bag of 550. Those look really, really good. There are a few with knobbly bits, but that's normal. But overall, they look really straight and flat. The three tens are notorious for being difficult. It'd be hard to show you through the bag. They look really good. There's a bit of trash in there, but I think it's going to be okay. There, it, you'll always have trash in the 310. It's just like it's super difficult to get those right. Okay. Yeah, those look amazing. And I like the colors too. So we have, you know, the whole rainbow of color. And this, this kind of painting would appeal to a lot of people, especially people who love pink. <laughs> so we've got all of our colors here. I like the fabric on the canvas. It's really nice. The glue feels really sticky. I think this is gonna be a really nice painting. Have you tried Pretty Neat Creative before? What do you think? I mean, for me, it's ticking all the boxes. We have what, what feels like care and consideration has been taken to make sure that they have a quality product. They're sending it in a really nice tube. They're making sure that you get a little bit of a discount when you're ordering several times with them. They have all of these packaged in their own separate baggies. No need to like fuss with all that plastic. They have a really good canvas, really clear symbols. I think I'm going to have to order 
from them in the future. And look, it says, if you have any questions, you can email them. So even if you don't have Facebook or Instagram, you can still email them. I think that's going to look really cute. Um, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and put it in here, right here, how much this would cost if you bought it today from the website, the day that I'm filming this and editing, but I believe that a 30 by 40 custom, which is what this came up to, was something in the realm of like $25 or something like that, which is pretty expensive, but when you consider that it's got this really nice canvas and the drills are all ready to go and they look to be excellent quality. I, I would have to test out the painting first to know, but if, if the care is being taken to this extent, then I'm gonna have to try them out in the future. What do you guys think? Please let me know down below if you've had a Pretty Neat Creative and what your experience with them was. I'd love to hear it. And like I said, if you'd like to, to use that, please go ahead. Um, and check them out and I'll leave the link to this painting down in the description of this video if you want to uh, to go head on over and, and look at what they have so thank you all so very much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it if you did you know what to do and I will see you all very soon in my next video take care guys bye